Over the years, we've published literally hundreds of blog posts about Drupal at OS Training. And invariably, people ask some really great questions. Hi, my name is Rod Martin. This is OS Tips from OS Training. And in today's video, I'm gonna take one of those questions from one of the thousands of blog posts that we have, and I'm gonna answer it right here in this video. Well, the question was about how to randomize the output of a view and have it show up in a different order every time you refresh. Well, that seems pretty simple, and yet there's a couple of little tricks to it. Let's dive in. So I'm here at a brand new Drupal site, it's Drupal 9. I've got a view with a content type called hotels. I've got teaser mode going on here. And as you can see, I've used Devel to generate just a whole bunch of hotels. Let's go ahead and edit the view. And right now the view isn't being sorted at all. So let's take care of that first. Again, the question was, I need my output to be randomized every single time somebody lands on the page or even when I hit refresh. So again, two things. Let's click add. And fortunately, Drupal has a randomizer built in. So look for random, put a check mark, click add and configure. There's nothing to change here and click apply. Now that's all good and well, except you probably know that Drupal caches the output of every single page and pretty heavily, I might add. So let's take a look at how we fix that part. Head over to advanced, scroll down to the bottom and you'll see caching is tag based Click on that and change it to none. Now, this is gonna remove the caching from your view and therefore make your site, at least this page, a little slower, but hopefully not too bad if there's not too many results to go through. I'm gonna click Save. And watch when I hit Refresh. Every single time, my listing is now in a completely random order. Well, that wasn't too hard now, was it? That's one of the things I love about Drupal and I love about the readers at OS Training. They really push us to build some great blog posts and then they ask some really great questions that, well, let us share things like this with you. You know, just recently on our channel, we passed 40,000 subscribers. Thank you so much. It's really awesome. So would you do me a favor? Well, if you haven't, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the like button, it helps. And we'll see you next time here at OS Tips from OS Training.